What's up guys, Chandler here from Podium One Racing. And right here is one of the coolest, and in my opinion, one of the best bang for buck haptic additions you can add to your simulator. It is the Cubic QS BT1 seatbelt tensioner. You get a four point harness. The saw belt here one is amazing. It attaches down here to the direct drive, uh, little straps on the seatbelt tensioner, and it'll simulate most of the G-forces that you would feel in real life. So lateral Gs, your acceleration, your braking, and then it's also dynamic. So for instance, if I'm turning right or left, it'll pull the straps necessary to simulate the forces that I would feel against the seatbelt in a real car. Now, before trying a seatbelt tensioner in general, I don't know if gimmick's the right word, but I, I didn't know how it would be. Now that I've tried and I've raced and flew with a seatbelt tensioner, I severely miss it when I'm in a sim that doesn't have it. So this kit we've put together is for existing Podium One customers or customers, even if you built your rig at home, that have an extruded chassis like this. For our flat face Podium One systems, we need special brackets. So we've put together a whole kit that will include the four point saw belt racing harness, QS BT1 seatbelt tensioner, the brackets to plug and play bolted on, and then all of the wiring to plug and play with our wiring that we have built your system here at Podium One. So the USB hubs, USB extensions, uh, the software installation, all of that, including a full video tutorial of how to install this on your sim. Whether you have a D-Box system or a non-motion system, this would work for you as long as you haven't extruded this specific product link that you're on, which is our seatbelt tensioner kit add-on to an existing system. It's a great buy. Go and get it.